Okay, we're back once again with my summer car. So uh, it's officially Monday again, and uh, I'm gonna go pick up my new wheels from. Hmm. There we go. So what I'm gonna go do now is probably take these wheels over to Fleetari so I can get some uh, drag tires for them now. Actually, while we're here. I might do some shopping too, I guess. Alright. <clears throat> hmm. Let's see, what else can I grab while I'm here? Oh. He hasn't restocked yet. I will grab some milk. Oh, yeah, there we go. Just like drink. I think this is probably like a quart of milk. Yeah, I'm gonna just drink four quarts of milk. Here we go. Hang on one second. Oh, yeah, there we go. There we go, baby. Alright, I think we're good now. Let's go head down to Fleetie Boys. I'm actually gonna see if I can find some of my. Uh, car parts that fell off during the rally which includes my front splitter and my bumper so so as you might have saw in my description of my last month's summer car video I figured out why I didn't get I didn't place what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to park a car up at the paddock and then stay there don't move or you will get a penalty for arriving late now I did arrive late too because I tried to fuel up after I finished the rally. So, um, yeah. So hopefully next weekend will be a little bit different. Rather than doing the two separate parts for the rally, I'm going to just try to do the whole rally in one episode. So, where is it? I don't see it. It's supposed to be. Oh wow. Well, there's the bumper. I was looking for the splitter. I was I got too confused. But here's the bumper. Kind of got a little uh, bent out of shape, but that's fine, you know. I believe the splitter is a bit farther down, over by the road to the Venti guy's house. So we're gonna go check out over there real quick. Alright, so I believe my splitter is by the uh, Venti guy's house. Well, by the road to his house. I really should go visit that guy someday. Like, like I want to see if I can beat him at poker, you know. Because if you beat him, and if you get, like, the maximum bet, you get the keys to the Starusco, which is, you know, oh, wow, big whoop, you know. It's the Rusco. But you do get the, the guy's house. If you lose, though, you, you could potentially lose your car and get stuck with the Rusco. Or potentially lose your house and get stuck with the venti house. Um, but the venti house is pretty cool because you can, you know, you can use it as some kind of uh, backup house, I guess, in case, I don't know, for some reason you burn down your house in my summer car, which I've done before on accident. Yeah, I know. Mm. My roommate's playing his guitar, I think, so they might hear something in the background. <laughs> Are you recording? Yes, I am. Okay, so, um, I, I may have, uh, fubbernucked with the, uh, fubbernucked? Paddles. Are you trying not to swear? Yes. Because of my dad. Yes. I mean, hey, it's okay if I think it's okay if you swear. He just cares if I swear. Okay, fine. I fucked up the uh, um, the uh, settings on my pa uh, my pedals for my guitar, and uh, you might be hearing that during the recording. So. Oh, okay. I mean, I'm o my, I'll probably will edit most of It'll it out. It'll just add character. It's fine. Uh, yeah. I guess I guess it is. You know, whatever. I don't really care. It's not like. 
There's like construction going on outside or something. Alright. Let's head over to Fleety Boy before he closes. It's about 12, so we got some time. I think it would be fun though, since I'm going to have to do at least two more junior sprints to get the 10 points to get amateur, the amateur uh, run. Maybe on my third rally weekend, I'll take the uh, I'll take the bike and see if I actually. Uh, because even if I get third place, I'll still have enough points to uh, do the uh, junior or the amateur rally. So, and plus it would save it would save some stress on my engine that I might have to rebuild again. So. You know, I looked at the stats after I did the route, and, and the engine didn't suffer that bad of uh, damage um, during the, uh, the rally. So I think we've got a little while. But what I plan on doing for the drag, though, is completely stripping out the vehicle and adding the nitrous, because that's the only way. That's the only only scenario I would strip the car out is for rally, or not rally for for drag. You know, strip it out, bump the boost up on the nitrous, tune the valves for like absolute power, and I want to see if I can beat um, some of those guys with the big muscle cars, like the old hot rods and stuff. Apparently, just a glitch. It was a glitch. You could beat them at the, with the with the moped. I don't know though. I don't know. That would be kind of cool. And kind of humiliating at the same time. So. But yeah, maybe I'll do the uh, maybe I'll do a video where I rally with the bike. You know, the bike is honestly not even that bad on the back roads, just as long as you don't hit too many bumps and go flying. You, you should be fine. And I have a wheel, so I I, I I do a much better job driving the bike with a wheel than keyboard and mouse. So, all right, we're here at Old Freedy Boys. I'm thinking of I'm 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 considering it might I might try tuning my valves on the uh, on the uh, Satsuma for the next weekend rally, but I don't know I don't know man I think they're fine the way they are like I said I think I would have easily won the rally if it wasn't for the penalty I got I would have easily won it so but yeah we got our new wheels here yes yes my car isn't here today so you can't. You can't, like, tell me, oh, your car is ruining my drive. Well, guess what, bucko? It's not here. So, there you go. You know? Alright. I'm going to just put these on the counter here. It's like, yo, put this, put tires on these, please. How much do drag switch cost? Anyway, hang on. How much do they cost? Uh, damn. Damn. Three grand. Well, only seventeen hundred with uh, the forty percent discount. So yeah, we're gonna get some drag slicks. Um, and there you go. Now we have only six thousand marks, which is fine. I'm thinking the wood guy might call me pretty soon, but I think I might hold off on doing any work for him until I finish all this rally nonsense. Because uh, you know me, I typically do it on. Saturday. Though I suppose if I got up early enough, I could do the wood job before the rally even starts, and then head back over to uh, town to go do the rally. So maybe let's we'll try that. I don't know. But yeah, I'm at the point in the game where, like, during the week, I have not much really else to do. You know, so I'm, I'm basically just waiting on people to call me for work. You know. Because I have all the parts now, you know. I'm thinking, gee, what do I do? Uh, basically, once I once I get all the rally stuff done, then I'm gonna actually fool around and stuff with the car, like, you know, see just how fast I can get that little car to go, you know. But for right now, my main focus is to win the rally. I want to get, I want to get it mostly for the achievements. But after I finish the rally and the drag. I mean, the only thing left to do is get the girl. And I don't know if this new update has like made it so Janie doesn't crash, but I haven't seen him die once in my new playthrough. So that might mean I might have to actually kill him myself, which isn't a good idea because I might go to jail. So, um, I guess the only way to like make him kill himself is probably to beat him, um, 
in a street race, which I want to do that too. I want to be him in a street race. That is my goal. That is my that is my destiny is to beat yellow car guy in a street race. So, so yeah, now that I'm home and now that I have all my stuff, I don't know what to do now for the rest of this video actually because like I've done I guess I mean mo you're not going to have a probably a my summer car video for the rest of the week most likely because um, I'm going to be just waiting to uh, you know waiting for the next weekend so which isn't a bad thing because I mean I don't think y'all want to see um, me doing a bunch of just boring stuff for the most of the week on these videos. Why? That's why I've been kind of skipping out most of the stuff because you've seen me do all the jobs, and it's basically the same story every time I do them. So, but I'm pretty sure when I get home, I'm, I might get a call from the wood guy, maybe, so I'll be able to uh, freaking uh, do that and get some money. But yeah, you know, maybe during the week sometime I might do a episode where I go see the uh, Venti guy after I do all the, after I get the wood job done and once I get all the poop jobs done for this week, I might use my hard earned cash to throw it away on some poker. <laughs> see how far I get before he gets pissed and flips the table over and is like, ah, you suck. But in fact, it is the venti guy who sucks because he is a poopy head. All right, here's what I'm thinking of doing actually. So, scapegoat did a thing where he would leave a v he would leave some stuff at the uh, shop or at the waiting area so he could he could camp out. So I thought, you know, why not leave the Rusco at the at the paddock area so that way next weekend if I need to camp out at the rally, I have the perfect vehicle the rest go so I'm gonna take this over as well as the bike put the bike in the back here over to um, the uh, the uh, shop and take the bike back home obviously um, so that way when this Saturday comes around again I'll be able to uh, camp out in the Rusco and not have to worry about you know getting a penalty again for leaving the Leaving the area or whatever, you know. So let's go ahead and... I'm a little nervous about putting the bike in the car. Hold on one second. I'm a little nervous about leaving the bike in the Rusco because this thing, it, it kind of makes the car handle a little funky as you can kind of tell. Um, yeah, 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 you see, you see, and I don't really like that at all, but nevertheless, I will attempt to do this while hopefully not dying, so. Uh, yeah, that, that seems fine. Prob I might put on the roof. I put on the roof, maybe? That might work a little better. That might work better, I guess, you know? Yeah, put on the roof. That... That works. Okay. Alright. <laughs> um, I guess we'll go ahead and head on down to... Uh, the shop. So, when the rally comes around again this Saturday, we'll be all ready to go. So... Go ahead and shut everything down here and get ready. Oh, I want to order something else too. I want to order the twin carbs because I want to get the achievement, um, with the Satsuma GT achievement where you bring the Satsuma back to its fact. It's like it's an optional GT trim, which means you get stuff like the window louvers and the spoiler and the shift tenor console and stuff like that. Um, so, I'm also going to order, I think that's it, I'll order this stat for now. Ooh, 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 ooh. 
Yeah, I think the bike doesn't like this. The Rusko doesn't like this at all. Suspension, can you please sh shut up? Thank you. Alright, we got it back up, and I totally did not use uh, grab anything to help me out here. Totally, I was def totally played it completely legitimately. It'd be fun to do a rally with this thing, but, uh, yeah, I'd probably crash after the first corner. Crash and die after the first corner, mind you. Not just crash, I'd crash and die. Oh man, Jesus Christ, this thing does not like having this much weight in the back of the car. I can tell. Come on, get up this hill, baby. There we go. There we go. Ooh. She about ready to... There we go. I think we can probably just roll the car the rest of the way to the paddock. Let's see. Come on. Oh, that's where Pino is. He got stuck, apparently. Well, good for him. Maybe he can give me a push the rest of the way to the paddock. Hell, if I knew he was going to be this close by, I would have. I would not even take the bike entirely. I would have just got a ride home from him. But, oh well. Alright. Should be good enough, right? Alright, there. We got the... We got the... Brush go here now. So come Saturday, we'll be able to camp out in it on the weekend. After the rally's over. So, that'll be good. Alright, I think this is it for this episode. I'm going to probably head on home now. Um, and, uh... I'll see y'all next time, I guess. So... Probably the next time will be probably the end of this week because, like I said, not much else to do left over in this game now. I might try to do some stuff with the Venti guy maybe this week, um, but we'll see. So, till next time, uh, I'll see y'all later. So, have a good one.